I'm Joanna Simpson here at Fun Forum International in Copenhagen. Joining me now is Ariana Alzeni, Group Head of Business Development Support at Cassis. Thank you very much for joining Thank me you, today. Joanna. And just tell me what part technology has in Cassis's business development strategy. Um, innovation has always been embedded in our NDA, it's even in our motto, we're solid and innovative and innovation in our industry today comes with uh, technology and technological advancements. Um, we have set up an innovation lab with our clients to make sure that our innovative projects meet their expectations and Fundform is a great opportunity for us to be here and share our thoughts with other innovators and network with them. And at the event here, we're talking about blockchain and uh, distributed ledger technologies as we have previously. Are we as an industry getting closer to practical applications for blockchain and how do you think this will disrupt the established business of custodians like Cassis? Blockchain is certainly a very interesting development coming from the fintech world. Um, however, we don't believe, as some have said, that it will replace our industry entirely. We believe it more that it will give us opportunities. And in order to be on the front line for that, we are currently participating in several market working groups and um, exchanges in forums. And we're more than happy to discuss about it here at the conference as well. And what do you think will be the biggest disruptive technology to impact the asset services? Uh, we talk a lot about IA and uh, quantum investing and all of those are really far away for our industry whereas I think RPA, robotic process automated, uh, automation, is going to come shorter term and it will really impact our industry by allowing computers to use softwares that were previously developed for humans and it will free our staff from repetitive tasks, will motivate them, will reduce errors and of course all of that will also increase our capacity of handling high volumes when need be because it will just have to be increase the processing power. And Cassis has a lot going on this year with acquisitions, partnerships and other major business wins. Uh, how do you think that will impact client servicing? Well, indeed, um, we're very happy. We have two major deals going on at the moment, one with a partnership with um, Santander Security Services and an ongoing purchase offer for Cast Bank in the Netherlands. Both of them fit perfectly our strategy of growth, um, Santander enlarging our market coverage and Cast Bank bringing on a whole wealth of uh, pension fund um, knowledge and expertise. Um, it is true that they come at the same time and this, they come at the same time as a lot of client migrations in which is great, a good, a good time for us. Um, we are confident we're going to be able to handle all of those at once because Cassis itself is born as a partnership and has grown through a series of acquisitions and hence we know how to put the means in place to be able to, to, be able to carry on all of those projects while ensuring that our clients will not see any disruption in our services and at the end all of our clients and Santander's and Casbank's clients will see an enlarged uh, service offer and opportunities worldwide. So busy time for you. Indeed. <laughs> Ariana, Zeni and Cassis, thank you very much for your time. Thank you, Joanna. Thanks.